My name is Scott Anger. Welcome to your second Blender 2.6 tutorial. In this tutorial, because it's Christmas Day, we're going Christmas Day at one o'clock in the morning. We're gonna make a Christmas tree for right now. So let's open up Blender 2.6. Oops, that was the wrong one. Sorry, guys. Let's open up this one. Here we go, this is the right one. Okay. And now we have everything here. We can actually press the T button to get rid of that. And let's just take a side view. And quickly let's click our delete button and get rid of the default cube. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a new mesh, and it's different from 2.49 because you don't use the space bar anymore for that. You hit or shift A, and it brings up the add menu, and you go to mesh, and we're going to add a cylinder for the trunk of our tree. We're going to hit 3 to go into side view. We're going to scroll to zoom in. We're going to hit tab to edit and go into edit mode. We're gonna hit G Z control and drag it up to the green line. And drop it right there. So that's right on top. Okay. So now what I want to do is I actually want to uh I want to change the size of this. So we're gonna hit S and then we can pull it out or push it in, make it smaller and bigger. But what I want to do is I want to hit X.5 X point seven five. Point seven five. Enter S Y point seven five. Enter. And now we're still centered in the middle of a thing. And it's sitting right on top. So now what we want to do is we want to right click just to select or yeah, just select one of the vertices, and then you're gonna hit uh, Alt, and you're gonna click in between the vertices, and it's gonna select the entire top layer. Now to start beginning, to start to begin to. Make a tree. We actually want to drop this down a little bit. So let's plus three, zoom in again, shift, middle, mouse click, and I'll bring it up. Hit G, Z, control, and oops, we forgot to select one of them. Control, shift, the middle one, hit three again, G, Z. Control, and we're just going to drop it about that much, so it looks okay for tree trunk height. So now we're going to hit Control and unselect that middle vertice, and what we're going to do is we want to extrude so it goes straight out to add a new, add the bottom of the tree. This is this tree is just going to look like a, um, a very cartoon like tree so what we want to do is press E and then immediately after that not move the mouse or anything hit enter and then we're going to press S we might want to zoom out a little bit for this though and drag our mouse closer to there hit S and then drag it out to however far you think the first layer of the tree should be and you do that okay there's our first layer now you may be wondering well, what do we do next so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to hit 
control or no I'm gonna hit E Z and drag it up actually hold up a second before we do that I want it I'm just gonna click again control Z I'm gonna go to side view mode and let's let's bring it right up to here so we're gonna hit uh, E Z control and bring it up to that line and now what do we do because this is just it looks like a cylinder and it's, it's just gonna look weird well what we want to do is we hit three and we we're gonna want to hit a I guess a nice looking angle so we're gonna hit control or, or hit S oops no not that hit S control and we can just drag that in to right about there and there's our first layer of the Christmas tree so now to make more layers all we have to do is do the same exact thing we, actually let's make this smaller S shrink it in because we gotta add more layers so it looks more correct and we just gotta hit extrude and actually you don't want to move it you just want to press enter right after doing that then you don't want to hit S and make it a size that looks appropriate for your thing. I think that would be good. And I think I'm just going to make this one box height. So E, Z, not Z, not X or Y, Z. Hit control and just drag it up to that first line. Actually, you know, G, Z, control, and I'm going to drag it about halfway. No. I think I'll drag it three up above that first line. I'm going to hit the size. I'm going to want to shrink this again. So it looks about the same as the first one. Okay. Let's look at this. Our tree is looking actually quite nice for so far. It's not professional, but it looks okay. Control, control, shift, and the mouse. Move the mouse wheel, or uh, click the mouse wheel and move your mouse to change where your focus is. Then you're gonna hit E, enter, S, make it the size you think is appropriate. I think that's appropriate. Then E, Z, control, and drag up to what you think would look nice or looks right. It's better to have them get smaller and smaller as you go up, and then you hit S, and you shrink it to what you think it looks right. Then you hit E, enter, S, drag it out, E, Z, shift, or control. E, or no, no, not E, S, and drag it in again. And then move up a little bit more, scroll up, E, Enter. Actually, no, 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 no. S. Okay. okay. I think I'll do one more layer and then it's finito. I'll make the top to it. Okay, so E, Enter, S. Scale it out to 
what you think is appropriate for the thing and hit E and Z control it's better to keep getting smaller each time but that one looks right okay size bring it in okay yeah this is the last one E enter S drag it out E Z control drag it up a couple and, and since this is the last one I, I don't think no we won't put ornaments on this but since this is the last one we want to make it so that it finishes correctly in the center so just draw a line from the outermost one to the middle and if it looks about right parallel or close to parallel with all the other ones you can just hit alt M and mer this is a merge and then just hit merge at center and there's the finish of that Christmas tree I have to say that looks actually quite nice for a quick tutorial wouldn't you say well I guess I will actually here what we want to do is we want to file we save as because we don't want to lose our thing I saved mine in a certain folder in my M drive because I have a hard drive there and I'm going to go to blender files models blend and create a new directory it's got to be on a green directory and I'm going to add Christmas tree tutorial enter then we're going to go into that folder add new directory zero. I, need, I just like uh, using this so that I know what's going on and we're just going to put uh, Chris Christmas underscore tree underscore tutorial enter it's gonna add the blend thing and we're gonna save as blender file. What I wanna do is I wanna actually before we do anything I wanna write I wanna go into my computer, go into my media drive, go into Blender uh, actually, no. Under files, models, blend, Christmas tree tutorial, one. What I want to do is I want to copy and I want to create a uh, a secondary file of this, and it's going to be a copy, so that I can work on this myself without messing up the original. So. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I'll see you guys next time. Please like. Uh, do whatever you want. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good Christmas. Merry Christmas. Bye.